Oh my, this is the world's smallest art canvas. Thank you. And this is the world's largest canvas. And this is the greatest artist on the entire internet. ZHC. He's customized iPhones, cars, boats, and even a giant house for Mr. Beast. His absolutely insane art skills have earned him over 24 million subscribers, and he's one of the fastest growing YouTube channels on the entire planet. ZHC. Hi, guys. And well, as you can see, I'm a very bad artist, which is why instead of getting art lessons, I'm going to bribe ZHC with the world's largest art canvas in order for him to teach me how to draw a stick figure. The only problem is, is that ZHC is super famous, which means he's impossible to get in contact with. He's uh, also in Texas, which is 1,500 miles away. But I did hear he was coming to Anaheim, California for VidCon, which is a convention for YouTubers, which gives us five days in order to figure out how to build it, get in contact with his team, and also surprise him at VidCon. First things first, though, time to head to Home Depot. We're going to Home Depot. We need to get material. However, I don't know how to build the world's largest canvas. I know it might look like I can. Guys, I'm so good at this. But I can't. Which is why we need the absolute best, most professional YouTube builder of all time, which is actually right here. Let me introduce you to Jared. Jared is literally the guy who builds all of Arak stuff. So if he's good enough for Arak, he's definitely way, 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 way too good for me. But it's good that we have him here because knowing me, stuff's probably gonna end up going super wrong anyway, even if we have him. That's foreshadowing. Everything goes wrong in this video. Anyway, while Jared and I grab all this wood, here's the game plan. Instead of building one giant canvas, we're gonna build four very large canvases with the ability to connect together. Like a transformer. And after that, we're gonna build a 17 foot tall easel to hold all of it. The total build is gonna Gonna be close to 20 feet tall which is almost two stories so we basically need lots of wood big screws we need lots of these staple gun this is number one choice but this is best in america so which one do we do jerry and friendship that's what friendship sounds like now for the magic question how much does this all cost over 500 dollars. oh my god please remove your card that might not sound like a lot but for someone with zero subscribers that's a lot oh and by the way this video is going to get much more expensive just wait like for example the raw canvas was 250 dollars. love that for myself i'm paying you in friendship right now because i just realized that we can't dm this team until we finish the canvas jared and i got to work right away yeah Woo! go jared now that all the wood is cut, we need to build the four individual frames. This took literally all day, and there were so many screws, washers, and nuts. However, while Jared is doing that, I have to go pick up the canvas, which is 40 minutes away. I really don't have time for this, but we don't have a choice. Here's me picking up the canvas. Looks good. Now it's time to get started on the easel. Look how big this easel is, dude. We're gonna cause a giant scene at VidCon. Let's do this thing. The easel was so complex, but I'm not gonna bore you with all that, so boom, done. After 10 hours of endless work, we have the main frame done. Now we just need to lift it up. What what could go wrong? That's more foreshadowing. Did I even get that? It's midnight. We're gonna have to rework this entire thing. <laughs> We're gonna have to wake up early tomorrow morning. We only have three days left. At this point, guys, I don't know if we're gonna have enough time for this. I then went to sleep and then woke up to this video from Jerry. Here we are doing our second round of shopping. Luke, I'm sorry, but we had to spend a very large amount of money for the second round. Jared, do you have anything to say for yourself? Do you know how negative a bank account can go? I mean, That's a real question. A couple thousand at least. Okay. This was where the reality of the situation was starting to hit me. I was in trouble. And we have no plan. <laughs> uh, no we've plan. No, still no plan. Look at the pure fear in my eyes. Literally zero plan of how we're gonna get ZHC to actually take it. Look, right now all that matters is getting the canvas built. We had all four frames connected and built and we just need to add the canvas. earlier I said this video was gonna get way more expensive yeah that's because one person who subscribes is going to get a thousand one dollars the only rule is is that you can't like this video I don't care about likes just subscribe if you think I put effort into this video and plus you can win a thousand and one dollars so why not we're gonna move the canvas from there to the easel now we didn't expect the canvas to be easy to move but this definitely wasn't supposed to happen two, two one Bro, you get, you get set? up, up, but with a little luck, and we had finished. Oh, 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 oh bro, I'm like having to back up to more just to like see it all. That's crazy, crazy, yo! Look what? at this thing. What? Now, 
time to customize it for ZHC. Customizing this thing has been my favorite part because when ZHC sees this, he'll be so excited. As for right now, we need to take some photos of this thing so that way I can DM this to all of Zach's team. That's right, this whole video is relying on them opening their DM requests on Instagram. Once I sent out all the messages, we need to figure out how to transport this thing from downtown LA to Anaheim, California, where the convention was going on. I found a U-Haul that is 17 feet long and according to these measurements, it should fit. So I got the U-Haul. Okay. I've never rented a U-Haul. I'm 19 years old, I don't know what I'm doing. Who the frick trusted me with this truck? Okay, how do I move up the seat? Okay, I'm driving the truck downtown Los Angeles and I'm vlogging and I don't know what I'm doing. We're literally just in the middle of the street right now. We can't be here, we gotta go. Yep, yep, go. Woo. We're gonna turn all the way around. Yo, it's going good guys, for sure. Don't, we're, we're fine, we're totally fine. Oh, does it fit? Dude, it fits barely. This is where we hit a wall. Or a truck. Uh, this, the truck was too small. Does it not fit? See that little piece? That one little piece? Pull, pull your side down a little bit. No. Yo, I don't know if it fits. Yo, yo, it's, it's bending. The measurements online show the 17 foot truck only being actually 14 feet long, which is fine as long as we can lay the canvas diagonally along the edges. However, it didn't show that the gas tank created a metal block on the inside of the truck, meaning this wasn't gonna fit. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna fit. You're telling me it doesn't fit? Plus, the surprise was supposed to happen tomorrow at 9 a.m. and the U-Haul place closed 30 minutes ago. So yeah, we failed. I wasn't able to make it to ZHG in time and yeah, I- Oh, what though? Wait, what? The other side doesn't count. Oh, you're right, yeah, flip, flip, flip. Jared to the rescue. Oh. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Oh my gosh, dude, it barely Yes, fit. yes, yes, that's money. That's money right there. This is so stupid. Next was the easel, which was simple enough. Jared's being a superhero right now. I don't know what I would do without. Links is in the description for Jared. Go go say so. We'll say what's up. We're, guys, we're fitting by that much. It fits. Jared. All right. CHC, here we come, baby. This wasn't the only good luck we had that night either. Once I got home, I opened Instagram and saw this. This is my genuine reaction, so if the, if the camera looks bad, just ignore it. I just got a DM. Holy crap, bro. Ha 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 ha. I'd be down to help out, but let me just say, wow, that's so sick. Let's go. Yes. Yes! Oh, we were down to the wire here. Thank you, Jesus. Love that guy. It's gonna work. It's gonna work. If you guys don't know what this is, basically I'm gonna hit a million subscribers by my birthday. If you believe in me, hit that subscribe button. Uh, cause I believe in me and I believe in us. Now that we have made contact with ZHD's team, we could craft the master plan for tomorrow. We're gonna set it all up to be at the hotel that Zach is staying in. Now, I just have to get everything there in one piece. I'm not gonna lie about this. I was very nervous. The canvas is in the back. All right, we got this. All right, I'm headed to the hotel now. Once I got there, this is where things got interesting. I realized that not only was this the hotel that ZHC was staying at, but all the creators were staying at. I'm talking Mr. Beast, ZHC, which means the security was absolutely insane. There was, there was way too many security guards. And look, I'm just a kid wearing a construction helmet with the world's largest canvas in the back of a U-Haul that he doesn't know how to drive. Look, man, I haven't been trained for this. So here goes nothing. We are going through the back entrance. We just have to ideally not get stopped. What's up, boss? How you doing? We just got to get around here. Let me verify that, okay, boss? Yeah, for sure. Just a little bit if you can. For sure. Because you don't have the credentials and she doesn't know anything about it? Absolutely denied. So instead, we went to the hotel right next to theirs. Problem solved. However, we didn't have time for this because we only had 15 minutes to set everything up. Or we were gonna miss the opportunity to film with ZHD because his producer said he was leaving that afternoon. It was down to the wire. It was now or never, for real. So we were able to set it up with no problem. Now, all that was left to do was surprise ZHD. All right, Luke left me in charge, just got into the hotel. We have Zach with us. I, I woke up like 10 minutes ago. Yeah, basically. We all did, yeah. Our friend Luke has a surprise. Do you have any idea what it could be? Yeah. <laughs> What's up, YouTube? Say hi. Hello. Oh my, yo, my stomach just went through my leg. Holy cow. Wait, that is actually pretty big. <laughs> I'm kind of nervous now. We got Kenzie, we got Jake, we got Ben, and we got the man, the myth, the legend, ZHC, right here. My name's Luke, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. First time meeting. Do you have any idea what that thing is? Um, a tarp. <laughs> Can you like cut the ribbon or something? Yeah, you want to cut the ribbon? Oh, that's all you. Whoa. Yeah, I have sharp. That's why you don't meet strangers in the parking lot. I got sharp objects. <laughs> well, I didn't know you actually had scissors prepared. Cut it. Yeah, just cut it. Yeah, do your thing. All right. All right. Snip. 
We have the world's largest art canvas. Oh, whoa. This is a giant easel? This is a giant easel too. Yeah, the easel is very impressive. We can make some pretty cool paintings on this. Which is why I'm actually here to ask you, can you teach me how to draw a stick figure? This is essentially, I'm bribing you to help me draw a stick figure. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm qualified, but let's give this a go. Okay, amazing. <laughs> an art lesson. This is all for an okay. art lesson. So you're gonna wanna pay attention. Okay. Zach then went on to give me the greatest art lesson of all time. And by the end of it, I wanted to show off my drawing skills. All right, your turn. Um, uh, I got this, I got this, I got this. Just, just one critique. Okay, this is mine. Hat. Oh, yeah, okay. that's, that's, that's true. Other than that, it's perfect. It's perfect. I don't know how big your trunk is, but it's probably not going to fit in there. I have no idea how we're going to take this back to Texas. We're going to find a way. Come to Texas with us? <laughs> you guys should subscribe to Luke. And one person who subscribes is going to get $1,001, so they might as well subscribe. Yeah, do it.